second one. What's the new relationship you're going to have to work with? x squared plus y squared is equal to what? z squared, right? Like this? Do the differentiation first. You're going to do this a bunch. Plus 2y times dy dt equals 2z, two, 2, not d, 2 what? 2z dz dt, exactly. And then what cancels now? The 2's cancel, right? And you want what? Which one do you want? You want dz dt when theta is 30 degrees and what? Well, y is, how high was it? 4,000, I think? And you also had already figured out what x is at that point, right? Natalie, what is it? You have the number over there, 6,000 something? Uh, 6,928.2. Like this, 2.2, yeah. right? So you know that x is 6,928.2, and then you need dx dt. Oh, you know what that is, because that's the speed of the plane, right? Mm -hmm. So what is it? It's getting bigger, so it's positive. Plus, well, what's y? Oh, 4,000 times. What's dy dt? How fast is the plane rising or falling? So how fast is it rising or falling? Zero. Zero. Yep. And then z times dz dt, right? Which one did you want? Which one is the thing you want? Yeah, you can highlight it so you get dz dt, right? So which one's the thing you need to find? Z. And you know that's at this instant, right? So you know that z squared is equal to 4,000 squared plus 6,928.2 squared. Did you get z? Oh, you guys were about to do that, weren't you, Natalie? Yeah, what is z? What, 3,000 what? 8,000. Yeah, it should be longer, sorry. 8,000 what? Oh, it's 8,000 exactly? Yeah. Oh, cool. So then where's that go? Right there. And then you solve for dz dt. And what'd you guys get? You guys got 381.051 feet per second. Good, I like how you put the numbers in there. Let's check that with the answer over to the left here. And what'd you get? Let's see. Hey, look at that. Take a look. Take a, is that what we should have? Wait, wait, can we go back for a second? Yeah, absolutely. Um, yeah, sure. How did we get side of x? How did we get side x? The same way, it's literally what you just did there. Remember, look over there in the bottom left, right there. 4,000 yeah. divided by 1 over what, root 3? That's root 3 times 4,000. And guess what root 3 times 4,000 is? 6,928.2. That's what it is. All right. You got that? Yeah. Okay, I think that was the only one for that one. Um.